What we have here is an exact replica of Randy Castillo's set that he went on the road with Motley Crue. It's a drum workshop, drum set, and it is their newest, latest, and greatest hardware, shell combinations, hoop designs, and pedals, everything. Um, all I can say is, in a nutshell, there is no other drum set made today that you can pull out of the box and literally set it up like this and have it sound the way you're going to hear this. I have not done anything. Those guys are so good at picking out tonality, the actual pitches of the shells, and the tuning right from the factory that the drums, are, they're, they're just amazing. And this set is, you know, no different whatsoever. So we've got 24 inch kick drum and it includes the 24 by 8 I believe woofer in the front which this is the first time I've used a woofer and especially recorded it and I'm blown away. It's incredible. Uh, besides the bass drum itself being a 24 with two closed heads I'm miking it from the kick pedal side, the batter side uh, with the new AKG uh, D12 VR microphone. Soon to be coming out soon. Fantastic microphone as well. Very dynamic, very full range. So it's picking up the attack on this side. So the closed head on the front of the 24 is now reverberating, sympathetically vibrating, if you will, the woofer in front, which are two more closed heads with a May miking system D112 AKG microphone inside of that. So by recording these two ways and then blending them, the kick sounds unbelievable. Two up front, two on the floor, one kick drum, ride down low. He's added a higher pitch snare. This isn't quite a piccolo snare, but it's a higher pitch. This is an edge drum by uh, DW which is a very, uh, very uh, articulate, loud, kind of piercing drum. Uh, the snare here is a wood shell drum, so it's going to be warmer and a little bit beefier kind of attack. Uh, Randy plays Zildjian cymbals as well. Um, this is my configuration. This is set up pretty much like Randy would set up, which coincidentally, maybe this is something that we've, we've done for a long time. It's not all that unusual, but just where the symbols are and the heights and all that stuff. So that was really, you know, very familiar to me. He's also using a double pedal. In the past, he's used two kick drums. Uh, this configuration, as well as other configurations that he's used in the past, uh, it's a double pedal setup. So this is the set, and uh, you're about to hear it in action. <laughs> 